Stanley Sterilizer, Sterilizer Autoclave Solutions, StatumUSA.com, 704-966-1650. Uh, right now, I am going to install a condenser coil on a new, this is a new style Midmark M9. You just show a front door. Uh, with the cover off, so I'm going to install this, and then I'm going to show you how to put the cover back on. Um, so basically, you just take that, take that condenser coil, if we can get in here. And you screw it on that fitting right there. You get it on there so, it, you know, screw it in as far as you can, hand tight. If you go one or two turns and it and it stops automatically, you may have cross-threaded it so you, you don't want to force anything. 9 16th wrench on this back fitting right here. Half inch wrench on the inside fitting. You just want to take it one or two turns and a little, you know, quarter turn past uh, hand tight. Um, first, we're going to put this sleeve on. That just goes on like that. Then we're going to slide this on, like so. Then this coil goes on here, one hole here, one hole here, underneath this little lip, down, and then we take that and go like that. Um, we are going to put the back cover on first. Back cover, like so one screw get that in there nice one here take another one put it here don't screw these in all the way just screw them even sit them there depending on how it looks that one there we're gonna go to this side panel first there's two little latches on the bottom here they're gonna have to sit on, up under the lip. And that comes up to about there. Then we're gonna take the top cover. We're gonna come over here, come over here. I'm gonna take this connector. It's gonna go in there like that. Clips down. Then we're gonna take the front door. See this front part here? Lines up with the holes there on the front. Sits into place. Then uh, we are going to have to put the pressure relief valve. There's a screw in the pressure relief valve. There's a little clip. Uh, you're going to want to basically just push that down up in like that. And then make sure that the ring is hooking the uh, screw. In my case, I didn't have it, so I got to look back and now it's hooking the screw. Now you get your Phillips screwdriver in there and you just tighten that down. If you did do any repairs, from here, all I would recommend is I would take your other two screws, put them in here, tighten them down. I would do left or back panel, left side panel, top panel. Then I would go and screw all my screws down. Don't force anything. Um, then we can put the back ones in. If you did do any repairs to any of the valves or anything like that, I would recommend running a cycle in this position. Um, other than that, if we're, we already know that we ran a cycle and we don't see any leaks in here or something like that, then you just take this panel, put that one on. These two screws go up here. Screw those into place. Screw this one into place. You're good to go. Um, if you have any questions, again, our number is 704-966-1650. You can find a lot of videos and parts on statumusa.com. And if uh, you need us, we're here. Bye.